I decided I wanted to be a newspaper journalist. Really? And sort of accidentally picked the best school of journalism in the country, University of Missouri. Oh, that's a, the good one. Any huh? Mizzou graduates here? I probably not. <laughs> But um, I went to Mizzou, and while I was there, I decided to switch from being newspaper to being radio and television. But it's a great school of journalism, and it launched me on this career. And Sherry, I don't know about you. I'm sure comedians go through this phase, too. But yeah. I spent you know, several years starving my way through local news, yeah. and then three years at NBC News. And it never, I mean, there were times when I couldn't figure out how I was going to pay my rent and put gas in my car when I was in local news. And like, it was, it was You're really. You're speaking of stand up comics life. Right. Yep, that's exactly. Right. Yes. And it never occurred to me to do anything else. Like, Absolutely. I love what I do so much that it just, I never thought, oh, I'm going to, you know, quit and go back to law school, which was my plan yeah. B or. This is, this, yeah. is, this is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. I remember watching you. I remember when you took over for Barbara Walters yeah. when she left 2020. So did she give yeah, you Yeah, oh, any, God, that, my right? hair, helmet head. Oh, my God. Isn't it amazing when you see your hair back way when? It's so, like, so why didn't somebody pull me aside and help me? Because <laughs> we, they were all wearing the same hair. Like, you know. <laughs> well, actually, John Stossel looks pretty good, but... <laughs> Barbara and I are like, yes, we have the same hair. Job. I'm just, but I'm watching you both. Yeah. When you left, did she give you any words of wisdom? To me, she goes, why are you crying? That's what she said. You know, it was something, it was, listen, you know and I know, because we both worked with her, Barbara Walters was formidable. Yes. She was a force of nature, and just getting to work alongside her for all the years I did, and to watch somebody at the very pinnacle the yes. very peak and pinnacle of success in our business, work as hard as she did Absolutely. on every interview. Yes. Really, yes. it just taught me so much about oh you know, the work ethic and to never, ever get up or let, give up or let up. She was a tough critic. That I think was mostly she'd one. pick up the phone and call me and yell at me like, what, why did you do that story and why did you, you know? She was tough, but that she was, was Barbara. <laughs> yeah, that, that was Barbara. We, we both know, yeah. <laughs> That phone call. Yeah, that phone call. It's like, oh, God, it's what on the line. <laughs>